Okay, Greg, this is track number three. Let's have a look at your run at normal speed. Traveling much faster these days and looking more comfortable, looking more assured. Good clean technique. And we're actually seeing some calves here. We'll point those out in a minute when we have a look at it again on, on um, slow speed. But you're nice and smooth. There's a good rhythm there. We're seeing good rhythm and coordination. Nice control turn size. There's no random turn thrown in there as there were on the first run. So we'll have a look at this at half speed. Okay, you can see you're definitely moving up and into that turn. And look there, that's a nice position. Upper body's up here, lower half flexed here. Perfect. Come right onto that toe side. Move smoothly into the heel side. Look at that. No sign of your hip going forward. Upper body is here, lower half there. Front hand over the new edge, back hand over the opposite edge. That's absolutely textbook. Come up into the toe side turn, and look, calf track. See it here? Perfectly positioned, really balanced, front hand over that edge. Hips, knees, and ankles flexed, upper body upright. That's exactly what I want to see. Rolling into the heel side. Back onto the toe, again, nice clean calf. Come onto the heel side, dealing with those bumps. And starting to carve there too, look. Nice single line. All right, as you come up now into the new turn, again, leaving a nice clean track. We can cross the hill, steering, we can see from here, we can even see that front arm. So we know that arm is in the right place. We know we're getting rotation of the hip. You can see that you're looking in this direction. So that's a good heel side turn. Coming up again, rolling into the toe side, start to carve there again. Now the only thing that I would say that would improve on that little section there is the transition between the heel and the toe turn. If you can roll across, rather than press with the front foot and let the back foot follow, you're gonna get that break between the two carve lines. Little cross under turn there, that we know you like now. And I pulled alongside so we could have a look at your stance. Look at that. Balanced, flexed, great position. You don't need to pull your arms up and stick them out, but they're in the right place. That's a very relaxed stance. You're actually traveling pretty quickly. I like that, that's good. So Greg, you've come an awful long way in a short space of time. Really pleased with what you did this trip. Um, after just a very short space of time yesterday, you changed things. You're very good at listening and doing what I ask you to do. Keep it up. Look at this video every now and then. Remind yourself what's good. Look at the other ones. Remind yourself what's bad. And just stay on that track. Well done.